Hey, what's up? Welcome to the video. This is going to be a quick video um, about a new client that we got for Revoice. Our, I guess it's our first official client, which is really cool, uh, but the way that it came about is really interesting to me, and it really taught me a, a lesson about going into things with one sort of judgment or preconceived notion and then it turns out to be something completely different. So as many of you know, I run a podcast called Drummers Resource, so I interview drummers, but I also interview music industry people. So I'll interview record execs or managers or promoters or something like that just to sort of like round out the content about the music business for drummers. So that way it's not just drummers and and if you want to be a drummer or a professional drummer and you know work in the music business then you should have rounded out content as far as i'm concerned anyway that's not important what is important is how this client came about so i had an interview with andy grammer's manager and when we set up to do the interview uh we had a conversation we were talking back and forth and he was like and I was talking about management and how I'd be interested in getting into management. We were just kind of, you know, shooting the shit back and forth. And then we started talking about podcasting. And he said that one of his client or one of his one of his um, artists, Andy Grammer, was starting a podcast. And maybe there would be some way that I could help with that. And I said, coincidentally, I just started this company called Revoice Media, and we are helping people with podcasts and other content for social and distribution and all that kind of stuff. So he said, why don't I just connect you with the team, and maybe there's a way that you know you can get on a call. Maybe you can just help a little bit just to sort of start working with us a little bit. And it turned out that we went back and forth. We had a couple very long conversations, and I was like, yep, I can help with this. I can help with that. I can help with that. No problem. And today... Or tomorrow, I should say. Uh, tomorrow is the official release of The Good Parts with Andy Grammer. It's a podcast where Andy's going to be interviewing amazing people like Dan Reynolds from Imagine Dragons and uh, Lewis Howes and, and Lamar Odom from, from Hamilton. And there's a bunch of people who are going to be on this podcast, which is amazing. And But thinking about it, looking back, I when I went into this conversation with him, it was never about... How can I get something out of him? How can, you know, is like, I never in a million years was like, oh, this is going to lead to like Revoice's first official client. I keep doing this because we've been sort of helping people with other things along the way, but this is the first official one uh, signed on through Revoice, not just me helping them as a consultant or something like that. And I think that when you are do when you're constantly working towards the thing that you want to be working towards and you're sort of putting it out there like it's sort of that law of attraction kind of thing there's an idea of something called the reticular activator it's a super fancy word but all it means is when you have when you've never really noticed a particular car on the road right so say it's a toyota camry and you've never really noticed them and then you buy a black toyota camry now every time you drive around that's all you're going to see are black toyota camrys all over the place you're gonna be like oh my god i bought this car and everybody has it no obviously more people don't have that car it's just the idea that now that now you notice it and now that you see opportunities that are out there uh that you're looking for so by putting these things out into the world and by being conscious of those things, you know, when conversations come up, it sparks an idea and you're like, oh, I can help with that. Or you may say, oh, you know, you may be having a conversation with somebody and you're like, oh, yeah, I just started this thing. And they say, hey, this other person can help me with this. And like prime example, I took off from touring. I decided not to tour for a while when I was starting Drummer's Resource. And now I'm tr I want to get back out there playing more. So I started to let people know, hey, just so you know, man, I'm, you know, I'm looking to start playing live a lot more and start doing some more touring. And putting that out there and working towards that thing, all of a sudden these things seemingly uh, easily start coming to you. And what I don't mean easily, I don't mean easily like the work is easy, but I mean easily in terms of things just sort of start to fall in your lap or opportunities present themselves that never presented themselves before. And it's just a really interesting thing of one, if you're constantly working towards the thing that you want to be working towards and you're focused on that, then good things start to come out of it. And that's a prime example with this Andy Grammer podcast. I never, ever in a million years thought that I would be working with Andy and his management company and all that. And 
and it was just I would I just wanted to interview his manager about the music business and that was it and so now we have a client out of it and now we're I'm building a relationship with the company and everything so it's such an amazing thing to me what can come out of an idea or what can come out of staying on the path that you want to stay on or being open to different opportunities or putting things out there so I, this come I talk about this a lot on the podcast about getting gigs because one gig can lead to the next thing can lead to this other thing can you can introduce somebody can get introduced to you by this thing and you never know I always do this my hands it's the Italian thing anyway <laughs> I have no idea where that came from uh, so but a lot of times we look at one thing and we think okay how is that how is that going to get me to here? But the truth is it's not. It's probably going to get you to here or may roundabout get you to this way or that thing. So for me, it taught me getting this first client, this first official client taught me to one, be very open to different opportunities. Two, don't go into a situation with a with an agenda or anything like that. Like I said, I went into this this conversation. I wanted to interview him for the podcast. I added some value. I was like, sure, I can jump on a call with your team. I'm, I'd have... I'm, you know, I'm happy to help do whatever I can, answer any questions that you guys have, whatever I can do. And then it turned into, hey, can you just help us produce this podcast, which is now we're, what we're doing. So uh, just a quick lesson that that I learned. Like I told you, I'd be sharing sort of faults and wins and lessons learned and things like that. And that was just a lesson that I learned uh, getting this this first official client for Revoice. So and check it out. The, the, it's called The Good Parts with Andy Grammer. Be sure to head over to iTunes and all that and subscribe to some really great guests, some really amazing conversations and they get super deep on a lot of topics so i hope you dig that i hope you dug the video do me a favor please subscribe please subscribe please subscribe also please comment comment down here i would appreciate it i love the comments i love interacting with you i love interacting with you all right let's do it have a good weekend i'll talk to you soon peace